I think Leicester's journey is one that's looking to a future which is different from its past. It's had a past built on manufacturing and, and rural um, trades. Uh, the world has changed. Cyber's been invented. Service industries have been invented. And Leicester's future is really exciting, actually. Uh, built on a history of medieval kings and proud people uh, and going forwards into a really diverse, dynamic, complex community uh, that needs some sensitivity in how it's policed. So a lot of people see the East Midlands as being perhaps a forgotten part. Now I see it as an opportunity and I see it as a place that has needed an injection of uh, ideas and dynamics and uh, an injection of restoration. Uh, you've now got an environment that people want to be part of and want to get back into. And 25 years ago, people were moving away. So it really has changed the way that people look and feel about it. And we're responsible for managing 200 square miles of new national forest across the Midlands. I think Leicester um, is, is definitely on a journey of lifting its head up. Well, obviously we've had a boost with the football, but I just noticed over the last five, seven years, um, the fact that we didn't get City of Culture, I think, has actually galvanised the arts creative community to actually do their best and to keep moving forward, show the excellence that we have in the arts creative community in Leicester. And I think now there's a real buzz that's going on and people in Nottingham and other places are talking about what's going on. Dealing with a forest, you have to work on decades and centuries because that's the time it takes to get Firstly, a forest created, but then it has to mature and it has to be managed and it has to evolve. Now, if we think about society in the same way, would we build the same houses? Would we create the same businesses if we start to think, think in terms of decades and centuries? Leicester is a multicultural um, city, as we know. Um, that's one of the reasons why I chose to come here, because I come from Kent originally. So just having um, a city that's so diverse, pulled together in... Um, grow really because it's not just in football I think Leicester even economically we we've grown a lot um, over the past year so I think it's you know it's really evolved and it's still got a long way to go but it's exciting to be a part of that journey. My dad would always say that Leicester was God's own country 